So I just want to show you some of the uh, some of the finds that we've got out at um, at Alst, um on the Severn Estuary here. If you saw my last video, that was the location and the cliffs. Just a little close up here. So we've got some of this uh, this limestone from the top of the cliff with some fantastic uh, crystals here, which are sparkling beautifully in the uh, in the uh, glorious sunshine that we've got here. Um, but more importantly, we've got these fantastic fossils. So we've got some shells, mainly shells here actually. Um, we've got some that are preserved well, some that are preserved less well. We've got some uh, some that are upside down, and we've got the the uh, looks like a cast, but it isn't actually it's a full fossil. Um, some more shells here. We've got some smaller ones down here. We've got some fantastically preserved, a couple of fantastically preserved there. Uh, there and then this one is uh, more or less a complete uh, a complete what well, looks like a bivalve and there's also um, we found a, a, a section of the um, of the bone bed here which is absolutely fantastically preserved there and we've got about 50 fossils in such a small area so that's absolutely fantastic um, overall these are the ones that I'm taking home uh, we've We've used a hammer here. Um, I believe it's it's perfectly okay to use a hammer here on the fallen stones. So if you're coming here, make sure that um, that you have a hammer to be able to take the fossils out of the stones. But don't go anywhere near the cliffs. The cliffs themselves are quite dangerous. Uh, stay well away from the cliffs. And there's there's hundreds of fossils here on the um, on the fallen rocks on the foreshore. Um, so you don't even need to go near the cliffs and, um, and yeah, we found this in about sort of 15 minutes here. So absolutely fantastic. Really, really pleased. That's it from today. Thank you. I've been the Down to Earth Geologist. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this.